my hair straightener to heat up. This is gonna be my new filming room. Don't mind the chocolate brown floors, it's gonna be fur. Just wait until Hattie sleeps in here for a week straight, this will be all white. So as I'm waiting for my hair straightener to heat up and get ready through the day, um, I just moved in, into my house. I finally am out of that stupid apartment, and now I have about three times the cleaning space I have to do now. I lived in that apartment for two years because I wanted to find the perfect cute house for my dogs. Everything revolves around my dogs. And I'm trying to settle and I can do more filming and now I'm more comfortable filming rather than sharing common walls. And now I have walls without furniture and there's an echo in here. My battery, damn it. So, I'm finally trying to settle it into my new house because I want to have more time to film for you guys and get back on it because my favorite season is here. So sorry, so I'm sorry, so I'm sorry, so I'm sorry I've been a little bit MIA for the past month or more. But I'm going to try to break that curse because I myself have a full-time job as well. So now I'm just kind of like getting used to like I wake up every morning now thinking, where am I? I hate when there's hair on me. The best thing about my move is I moved into a town where I am literally two minutes away walk from the super target of this town. <laughs> oh my God, I haven't been to Target in like so long. As you guys know, I'm a Target-holic and I got silver for a bit. And then I had the case of fuck it's, And then so I just said, ah, fuck it. My boyfriend told me to go buy a plunger because I threw the old one away. And um, I said, plunger? And he said, yeah. Yeah, for your bathroom. I'm like, excuse me? You're the one who ate a cheeseburger and some hot dog. So I had to buy like a whole bunch of like house necessities. So, and usually I just go to Target, you know, to buy like toilet paper or ranch dressing. My baby wipes. What happened to my Alfonso? Target now changed it to Nando. Oh, you cute little Puerto Rican baby. Um, I had to get a bunch of baby wipes. I use these things for everything, you know? You can use this for cleaning, for makeup, painful trips to the toilet, for the dog's eye boogers. So I got some few drugstore kind of things that I want to stock up. I bought my new makeup room some presents. So I wanted to show you guys what I picked up at the store. Well, I got my nails did. This is um, electric blue. It's a gel polish, so I'm not sure. <gasps> Sorry, what color it is. Okay, so I got this e.l.f. baked eyeshadow palette because I never got my hands on baked. That stuff is too expensive and I break my makeup constantly. So there's no point of investing when there's so many much more better dupes at the drugstore. The palette in California? What? I looked at it and it's really, really pretty. It's kind of like very shimmery. Let's do a couple of swatches. See that? It's pretty. And I bought this palette because I want to show you guys how I do my makeup for work um, when you're in an office-like setting. Actually, the colors are really, really shimmery. I'm not much into shimmer. Um, Elf is cheap and their products I've noticed are getting better, better now. So, and I got this big, huge brush that I'm excited about. Look at this. Oh, soft like a multi -pole. Used it to like blend out my bronzer today. It's this huge two inch like kabuki brush thingy. This stuff is amazing for blending out your bronzer or your, um, you know, cheeks. It's super soft, but it's really like, like sturdy. And I typically like don't really buy like e.l.f. brushes because I have a lot of good brushes, but this one was definitely a really, really good purchase. Another palette I got is this NYX palette. This is the Wanderlust palette. And here's what it looks like. I love the fall colors on this palette. These two right here are my favorite colors because they're so pretty. And oh, I got a new mascara. Um, as you guys know, I use this L'Oreal mascara. This mascara is amazing. It's what I use for my eyes. If I don't like it, I'll return it. I'll just say I broke out in hives. To be honest, I got it because of the packaging. I loved the, um, the animal print on this thing. Here is the brush. Up, right? And it's supposed to give you like a little cat eye. I spent 30 minutes staring at myself in the mirror and pulled out all of my lashes for my lash extensions. And I'm trying to like kind of rest from lash extensions right now. Well, mainly because my gal who does it moved. <laughs> Last but not least, I got some new lipsticks. They're by Lori L. No. Yes. But I got one in the exclusive collection. This one is Ava. This one is Ava's pink. Huh. What well, me? It was pink, girl. Here's what the color looks like, and it's just kind of like a nude Mojave pink type. The one I got is JLo, and this one is Jennifer's nude. That's Ava's pink, and that's JLo's nude. Two Latinas getting dirty. 
<laughs> Anyways, um, so yeah, so yeah, those are the lipsticks and they're just kind of like the Ava, oh no, yes, wait. But Ava's pink is a little bit more matte. So yeah, those are what I picked up from Target right now. I'm gonna start to um, kind of redo this room slowly by slowly. But I'm so happy to be back because now I'm more comfortable in this filming space. And the dots actually love it. They white trash the backyard already. But right now I have a lot more unpacking to do and my boyfriend's building me a custom bed. So yes. I'm sorry I've been MIA. I've been trying to like kind of clear my head for the past month and a half with the whole moving stuff. But go ahead, throw me in all of your fall suggestions that you want me to do and I will keep them in mind. Thank you guys so much for being so patient with me. You guys are the best subbies. Okay, see you in my next video. Bye.